Hi everyone, it's Arwen Kathke here from the Cardboard Time Podcast with a side table review. Today I'm looking at Cascadia Rolling. Now there are two versions of this, hills and rivers with minor differences from each other. Uh, in the solo mode, you're going to roll your two dice and four central dice and then use those to gather one type of animal or more if you have a certain type of roll. You can then spend those animals with the cycling land cards to get different points and bonus bonuses. Uh, there's a little bit of combo potential in here, but nothing overwhelming. It's a really nice small footprint game. It was very easy to manage, even with some room left over on the sides. And best of all, no color vision issues with this whatsoever, which made it a absolute pleasure to play. Uh, the gameplay was really solid, and I'd like to dive more into it on a future episode of the podcast, and therefore, Cascadia Rolling Hills and Rivers both get a side table highly recommended.